Hello, ayan. Tuloy na natin yung pag-aaral ng piano. Ngayon, bago natin simulan, kailangan malaman nyo muna kung anong piano ang gamit ko. Ang gamit kong piano ay tinatawag natin electric piano. Ito ay sinasaksak sa dekoryente para siya tumunog. Unlike nung iba, yung acoustic na tinatawag yun ay hindi dekoryente. Yun ay acoustic, hindi mo siya ikakabit sa kuryente, matutugtog mo na siya. Unlike to kailangan ikabit mo muna sa may ay sasaksak mo muna sa outlet para siya tumunog. Dahil ito ay isang electric piano. Weighted din siya, katulad ng acoustic. Hmm, medyo mabigat din ang touch niya. Pero, siya ay run electronically. Okay? Now, ngayon, gagamitin na natin ang electric piano na to. Okay, bago nyo maumpisahan at matutunan ang mga ituturo ko, kailangan malaman ninyo muna ang mga importanteng nota na nasa ka piano na to. Okay? Let's start with uh, this one, yung groupings ng 3, 2, and 3, 3 black keys. Ayan, simulan natin dito sa right side. Meron 3 groupings of 3, 2 black keys. 3, 2, 3, 2, 3, 2, 3, 2, 3, 2, 3, 2. Kaya yung mga groupings ng black keys. The rest are white keys. Okay. Now, ang first note natin na tinatawag, di ba, alam na alam natin siguro lahat yun, ang first note ng piano, sa piano o sa music is Do. Yan. Lagi dapat importante yung malaman natin ang Do. Yan. Yan ang napaka-importanting note dahil siya ang umpisang-umpisa ng skala, yung nota. Okay? Nang naaralin uh, natin, kailangan alam nyo yung Do. Okay? Ang two black keys, eto, no? Okay. Hanapin muna natin, asan ba yung Do? Okay. Nakita nyo may mga 2 black keys, 2 black keys, yan. Yung group ng 2 black keys. Okay, umpisahan natin sa middle do na tinatawag o middle C. Ngayon siya tinawag na middle do o middle C. Usually nasa middle part siya ng keyboard. Ito yung buong keyboard do, yung piano keys. Nakikita nyo yan, okay? Ito yung middle do. Remember, this is the 2 black keys. Okay, katabi lang ng first black key, ito. Nasa left side nyo, pag nakaharap kayo sa piano, ito yung two black keys, nasa left side siya, yung white key. That is your middle do, or tinatawag natin letter name ng middle do is middle C. Okay, ulit ha, ito yung center part, okay, middle part of the keyboard. Usually, na kung merong tatak ng brand yung piano, madalas, malapit lang siya do, no? Okay, two black keys, again. This is your Do. That is our first note. Okay, Do or middle C. Okay, this is two black keys, Do. Ngayon, hanapin natin sa keyboard, o sa keyboard natin, o sa piano natin, lahat ng Do. Mag-start tayo sa mababa. Okay, ito yung mga mababang part from middle C. Ito yung mababang part. Okay, from middle C, ito naman yung pataas. Yan, tumataas yung pitch nyan, ha? Okay. Yung tunog. Okay. So, ngayon, simulan natin muna sa mababa. Okay, yung two black keys. Natatandaan nyo. Ito ulit yung do. Hindi siya middle do. Kasi wala naman siya sa gitna. Eh, do lang siya. Parang lower do siya. Okay. And then, two black keys. Do ulit na mababa. Yan. Two black keys. Ito yung do. Two black keys na. Ito na yung. Napunta na ulit tayo sa middle C or middle do. Ayan ulit. Dalawang black keys. Do. Two black keys again. Do. Do. Two black keys. Ayan, do or C. And then the last note over there is, this one here is, do rin yan. Okay, kasi group is yan. Two, three yung susunod dyan. Do na siya ulit. Okay. Ayan. So, napaka-importante na malaman natin ang unang note na dapat natin tutugtugin pag nag-uumpisa tayo mag-aral ng piano. At yan ay ang do. Mag-uumpisa tayo sa middle C or middle do. Again, eto ang do. Okay. Ang susunod sa do ay re, yes, two black keys. Nasa gitna siya ng two black keys. The middle of two black keys, re. And then, aakit pa tayo, mi. Next, fa, sol, la, ti, do ulit. Kasi nasa two black keys na naman. Ayan, okay. Paakit siya ng paakit. Paulit-ulit siya ng... Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Ti. Tapos uulit na naman siya. Okay? So, mag-start muna tayo sa middle notes. Okay? Ngayon, bago tayo mag-umpisa, bago kayo turuan ng mga music fundamentals, mga note reading, at kung ano-ano pa, 
bibigyan ko muna kayo ng finger exercises na magagamit nyo para maging maganda ang pagtugtog ninyo sa piano or sa kung meron man kayong keyboard or ano man ang gagamitin nyo kailangan maganda ang position ng kamay sa piano okay? so mag start tayo sa exercise number 1 okay? sandali lang ngayon gusto ko munang pakita sa nyo yung different finger numbers ng kamay para tama yung pagpaplay ninyo pisahan muna natin sa right hand this is My right hand, pasensya na kayo, medyo maraming ugat. Alam nyo naman, maraming ginagawa. Ayan, okay? So, let's start with finger number one. Sa pagpapiano, o sa piano, ang ginagamit na finger one ay ang thumb. Okay? Ito yung number one natin. One, tas two, three, four, five. Again, this is your finger. One, two, three, four. 4, 5. Yan. Sa pagpapiano, yan po ang 1. Sa gitara, iba rin. Okay. Ito naman yung sa left hand. Kung nakikita nyo, mga ugat ko. Ayan. Okay. Let's start with finger 1. Thumb ulit. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Again, this is your finger 1. Sa left hand, 2, 3, 4, 5. Tandaan nyo, laging 1 ng thumb. Okay. Right and left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 3, 4, 5. Okay, tandaan natin yan. Okay, go. let's go back muna. Ah, before pala tayo mag-play, kailangan pag nag-play tayo, i-curve natin yung kamay natin. Naka-curve. Okay? Parang bilog siya, pag hinaf mo, ganito siya. Yan, naka-curve siya. Oh. Naka, ganyan. Yung mga fingers, curve siya. Naka, parang letter C. Oh, naka-curve. Yan, hindi siya straight, but curve. Okay? Yung mga fingers. And then, pag mag-play tayo sa keys ng piano, See to it na ang nagpe-play, ginagamit sa playing is yung fleshy part. Ito. Ito yung fleshy part, yung laman. Hindi yung kuko. Okay? Hindi yung kuko ang magpe-play. Paggamit sa... Kasi, pag kuko ang ginamit ninyo sa playing, tutunog yan, madidinig yan. See? Kasi may kuko. Okay? Unlike ng fleshy part, o oh, see, wala kayo nadidinig, di ba? Wala na kang nadidinig kasi ang gagamitin nyo is yung fleshy part nyo, ng finger nyo. Ang magta-touch sa, sa white key or sa piano. Okay? Hindi yung, hindi yung nails. Okay? Yung fleshy part ng finger. Okay? Tapos curve. Yan, round. Medyo round siya. Bilog, half round. And then curve yung mga fingers. Okay? Ganyan. And then pag magpa-play kayo, huwag kayo magpa-play na masyadong malapit sa block. Key. Do not play very near the black keys. Bakit? Kasi, pag nag-play kayo, tatama yan sa black keys. Mayroon, masyadong close kasi, tatama siya yung fingers ninyo. Okay? And then, kung masyado naman malayo, ayan, may tendency na mahulog. Ha? Your hands or your hand will fall. Ayan, mahuhulog siya. Kasi mala, dito na siya oh, sa dulo, di ba? So, ang proper playing is kailangan nasa middle part kayo ng white key. Ito yung white keys, di ba? Okay, pang magpe-play, yung finger nyo should place here. Yan, sa middle part. Ayan, dito. Di ba? Nasa middle part siya ng white key. Yan. Oh. Okay. Ayan. Okay, sa middle part lang siya ng white key. Hindi pwedeng malapit sa black key. Hindi pwedeng malayo. May tendency kayong mahulog ang kamay nyo habang nagpe-play kayo. Again, inuulit ko, kailangan curb like so. I-demonstrate ko dito sa higher uh, do, side do. Let's start muna. Wait ha. Isin natin. Okay. Ganyan. Okay. Okay, next. Finger 2. See, tingnan nyo na. 3. Nasa middle part. 4. And then... 5. Okay? Okay. Let's go back to the middle do now. Okay? Try natin. Okay. Ito yung middle do again. Nasa sense, uh, middle part tayo, no? Okay? We'll start with this one. First five fingers muna ang gagamitin natin. First five notes. Do, re, mi, fa, sol. Hanggang sol lang tayo. Okay? Forget about the notes. Numbers muna gagamitin natin para madali yung tandaan. 
Okay, we will use fingers. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, yung five fingers muna sa five notes. Okay, kagawin natin, pe-play natin ang finger one ng four times. One, two, three, four. And then second finger, four times also. One, two, three, four. Third, four times. One, two, three, four. Finger four. One, two, three, four. And then finger five. One, two, three, four. And then reverse. O, baliktad or pabalik naman tayo. One, two, three, four. Finger three again. Four times. One, two, three, four. Finger two, four times. One, two, three, four. And then one again. One, two, three, four. Okay, pag magpa-play, kailangan ang finger sa magpo-push, okay? Siya yung magtutulak sa keys, okay? Hindi yung, hindi yung buong kamay, hindi rin yung buong wrist or shoulder kasama. Kailangan fingers lang, oh, see? Oh, ang nagpo-push lang yan, yung finger, see? Ganon. Let's start now. Start muna sa middle do, finger one, two, three, four, five. Prepare nyo na, position your hand, round your hand, curve your fingers, okay? Let's start now. Count four for every note. One, two, three. Finger two. One, two, three, four. Finger three. One, two, three, four. Finger four. One, two, three, four. Finger five. One, two, three. Finger four again. Two, three, four. Finger three. Let's go to our left hand naman. This time, okay, natatandaan natin, di ba kangina, sabi natin, ah, yung finger one is this one. Okay, layo ko lang ng konti, tumatama kasi sa kamay ko. Okay, excuse. Okay, let's play it. Start with me, uh, right, ah, uh, left hand now. This is your finger one again. Wait, yan. Teka, layo natin ng konti. Teka, ha, adjustment. Okay, okay. Finger one. This time, we're going down. Pababa naman. From middle do, bababa naman tayo. Three, four, five. Again, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So, I'll, I'll start na. Okay, four for each note again. One, two, three, four. Finger two. One, two, three, four. Finger three. Curve pa rin yung kamay. See, yung hand. And then, curve yung fingers. Round your hand. Ganyan. Oh. See, para naka-letter C ka lagi. Yan. Okay. Again, let's repeat it one more time. Adjust. Adjust again. Okay. We'll start with this one. Okay. One. Ready? A little bit faster this time. Mabilis ng konti. Okay. Middle part of the white key I'm playing. Okay. Round your hand. Curve your fingers. Okay, ready? Go. One. Mabilis ng konti. Three. Four. A little bit faster. Two. Three. Fingers three now. One. Two. Three. Four. One. Two. Three. Four. One. Two. Three. Four. Finger four. Two. Three. Finger three. And then, excuse, ayan, na-touch, uh, na-ano ko na naman yung camera, okay? This time, let's go to the left hand now. One, okay. One, two, three. Finger two. One, two, three. Finger three. One, two, three. Finger four. Three. Finger five. Yung small finger. Hindi nyo nakikita. 
Yan yung exercise number one natin. So, pag ipiplay, eh, sorry. Pag ipiplay nyo yan, kailangan yan, siguro mga twice, dalawang beses, or thrice para maganda. Okay? Now, let's proceed. Okay, exercise number two naman tayo. Okay, pasensya na kung medyo magulo dahil ako lang mag-isa ang nag-aano ngayon. Okay, now let's go to exercise number two. Okay, ano yon Okay, it goes like this. Okay, it's one, two, One, two. Okay, two times then. Next. Two, three, two, three. Okay, next. Three, four, three, four. And then, four, five, four, five. And then, reverse. Baliktad na naman. Five, four, five, four. Next. Four, three, four, three. 3, 2, 3, 2, 2, 1, 2, 1. Okay. And your exercise number 2. Okay. Let's start now with the right hand. Okay. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. 3, 2, 3, 4 now. 3, 4, 4, 5. Then, balik tad, reverse, 5, 4, 5, 4, 4, 3, 3, 4, 3, 2, 1, and then, right hand now, let's start, 1, 2, 1. Practice nyo yan. Three times. Twice. Bahala kayo kung ilang beses nyo tutug gusto nyo tugtugin. Importante, tama yung position. Tama yung way of playing. Okay. Lagi mag-start sa middle do. Right. Middle do. Left finger. One also. Okay. Next. Now, punta na tayo sa exercise number three. Okay. Paano naman yon? Exercise number three goes like this naman. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, three. Next, two, three, four, two, three, four. Next, three, four, five, three, four, five. Pabalik or reverse, balik tad, five, four, three. 5, 4, 3, 4, 3, 2, 4, 3, 2, 3, 2, 1, 3, 2, 1. Okay. And play na natin. Start na natin i-play. Okay. Okay. Position your hand. Round your hand. Curve your fingers. Okay. Start with the middle dough. Going up. 1, 2. Sabay kayo. Ayan. 3, 4, 5. 5, yes. Balik lang. Go back. Okay. Good. Okay. Easy. Next, 4, 3, 2. 3, 2, 4. 3, 2, 3, 2, 1. 3, 2, 1. Okay. Next, yung left hand again. Ngayon, move natin ulit. This time, para makagalaw ako maigi. Yan. Okay. Let's do it. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 2, 3, 4. 2, 3, 4. 2, 3, 4. 
And then, adjust natin ng konti. 3, 4, 5. 3, 4, 5. And then, reverse. 5, 4, 3. 5, 4, 3. 4, 3, 2. 4, 3, 2. 3, 2, 1. 3, 2, 1. Okay, I'll play it. 1, 2, 3. Pababa naman, no? 1, 2, 3. Next, 2, 3, 4. Sa middle part ng white key. Magpa-play. 3, 4, 5. Curve your fingers. Okay, curve it. Round your hand. Pabaliktad. 5. Balik. Baliktad na. 5. Let's play it one more time. Right hand. A little bit faster na. Mabilis na ng konti. Go. Yan. Binilis na ng konti. Two, three, four. Three, four, five. Five, four, three. Five, four, three. Five, four, three again. Four, three, two. Let's go to the left hand. Mabilis ng konti. Then, a little bit faster. Let's position our hand first. Ready? Go. One, two, three. One, two. Two, three, four now. Three, four, five. Five, four, three. Five, four, three. Sana nasundan nyo ako. Sundan nyo yung mga exercise na ginawa natin today. Ngayon, let's try another exercise. Exercise number 4. Okay, try na natin yung 4. Okay, it goes like this. Okay, madali lang siya. This time, we will use the 5 fingers now and the 5 notes. Yung Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol. Sol, Fa, Mi, Re, Do. Or numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay? Mabagal lang muna. Okay? Yung limang notes ang ipa-play natin gamit ang ating 5 fingers. Okay? Ready? Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then balik again. Go back. 4, 3, 2, 1. We will do it 3 times. Back and forth. Another one. 1, 2, 3, 4, Five and then five, four, three, two, one. Last one. And okay, that's it for the right hand. Now let's go to our left hand. Ganun din siya. We start with finger one, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one. Three times din siya. Back and forth. Okay? Ready? Let's start to the middle though again. Going down. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one. Again. One, two, three, four, five. And five. Exercise number 4 na tayo, no? Okay, let's review. Yung exercise number 1 is 1, 2, 3, 4 2, 3, 4 1, 2, 3, 4 1, 2, 3, 4 Okay, go back. Pwede nyo sabayan to pagka gusto nyo ulit balikan. So, sabayan yung practice natin and playing. left hand turn second finger four times for each note for each finger
that's uh, exercise number one. Now we go to exercise number two. That is one, two, one, two. Ready? Go. Exercise number three. One, two, three. Okay. Position your hand. Ready? One, two, three. Ready? Go. Exercise number four, the last one is one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. So we'll do it three times back and forth. Okay, ready and go. Maganda siguro kung nakakasabay kayo o sasabayan nyo ako. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay? Go! Sana nasundan nyo yung mga finger exercises na tinuro ko ngayon. Practice nyo yan habang nag-aantay kayo ng next lesson natin. Siguro more on music fundamentals, mga basics, mga counting reading of notes. And then baka mag-upload din ako ng about chords. Kung sinong gusto na matuto mag chords, medyo baka isusunod ko na rin siya para madali nyo magamit. Ayan. Okay, so far, ang gusto ko lang mayari sana, i-practice nyo yung how many exercises, four exercises ang ginawa natin ngayon, next time magbibigay ulit ako ng bago basta't i-practice nyo lang yan, again yung hands natin, laging round curve yung fingers okay, ang magpupush ng key yung fingers, hindi yung braso hindi yung kamay, hindi yung wrist okay, eto lang, fingers yung magpupush nya huwag kang may discourage pag nakita yung kamay nyo medyo ganun ganun matigas or hindi pa kayo masyado kasi ganun talaga pag nag Sikapi nyo lang na huwag magpa-flat ng kamay na gano'n. Mahirap tumagdo na. Hindi kayo makakatugtog ng mabilis pagka naka-flat ng kamay nyo gano'n. So make it a habit na laging round your hand, curve your fingers. Para masanay na kayo. Kasi importante yan. Pag naumpisaan nyo na maganda ang posisyon ng hand nyo, mas madali na kayong tumugto. Yan. Okay? So again, re-reviewin natin yung mga finger exercises na binigay ko. Sana uh, ulit-ulitin nyo yun. Siguro mga 
twice or thrice. Bahala kayo kung ilang beses nyo ulitin yung every exercises. Ngayon, kung gusto nyo nang malaman yung mga exercises, ilalagay ko siguro sa description para makita nyo ano mga exercises ang ginawa natin today para mapapractice nyo siya. Okay? Para later on, sanay na kayo. Huwag madi-discourage kung nahihirapan, ganun talaga pag nag-uumpisa. Miski naman ako nung nag-uumpisa ako. Hirap na hirap din ako na mamalo pa nga ang teacher ko noon. Yeah, ganun. So, at kaya I make it a point na bago ko magturo, binibinga ko muna ng mga simple, uh, mga basic exercises para pag tinuruan ko ng note playing yung estudyante ko, madali niya na magagawa. Hindi na siya mahihirapan, hindi na siya mag-a-adjust-adjust ng ano, kamay niya, hindi na nakatikos yung kamay niya, tutugtog na siya kagad. Yeah. Yung placement ng no, ng hand, ng fingers sa sa keys ng piano. Okay? So, siguro yan muna. Dapat tutuloy natin. Abangan yung susunod kong tutorial. And then, kung meron kayong mga suggestions, meron kayong mga comments about sa lesson na yung today, pwede kayong maglagay sa comment section sa baba. And then, kung nagustuhan nyo, hindi ko pa yung super force na i-like or subscribe. Nasa saan nyo po yun. Kung nasyahan po kayo or ano, kayo na po ang mag-decide kung isa-subscribe or ilalike nyo. Ang maganda po, i-share nyo na lang po. Ito ay libreng piano lesson. Again, I am Teacher Raquel. So, uh, that's it for now. And then, uh, sana i-look forward yun yung next lesson natin. Okay? Okay, that's it. Okay, keep safe and thank you. Bye!